for the artillery to fire for support of the artillery. The cannons are now loading again to support the cavalry. They will be firing again. And Stonewall Jackson had a horse he bought for his wife, and it was, he actually ended up riding himself in battle with right. Sorrel. But one of the attributes of Lil Sorrel was he's very calm in combat with the noise and all around him. Fire by peace from the right. Again, you would have artillery support far behind them. Now, what you would have with this is if you drive the enemy off. Now, in a full blown out battle scenario, what we would have the infantry would come into the field also during this time period. 80% of the army is made up of infantry. 80% that's it, they, that's all they would shoot. That was your arm. That was your main force. These guys would come into. The as the cavalry soldiers charged the woods and drive the enemy back, they were able to encounter a force they could fire. They could force back which was using artillery and the infantry. Once again, it just depends on the amount of force you have at your face and what you could handle. Some of these forces are small forces moving across areas. Some are guerrilla forces and you also actually could encounter a large army such as Confederates did. Now, as the Battle of Shiloh, as our cavalry and infantry and artillery was here and involved, they did suffer great casualties. The 6th Mississippi, which was involved, 